I was like, I'm getting out of here. He's like, well, don't order anything else but no cheese. Because apparently it means something else. First at five and only on six, Skyatook police arrest a fast food worker for trying to sell meth out of the restaurant. Thanks for joining us today. I'm Jonathan Cooper. Craig and Lori are off. News on Six's Brooke Griffin spoke with a man who unwrapped his burger and found the drugs. Brooke? Well, Guy Cornsilk says all he wanted to do was grab a quick bite to eat, grab a burger last night after work. But he says whenever he unwrapped his burger, he found something that just wasn't on the menu. So then the guy actually brought me my food while I was at the table. He said, here, enjoy. And I was talking to her, poured my fries out, unwrapped my burger, went to take a bite of my burger, and they, they have a second wrapper on there, and I seen a baggie hanging out. Guy Cornsoak says he always orders the same thing at Carl's Jr. A number one, no cheese, and large. But this time, he got more than what he paid for. I was like, I'm getting out of here. He's like, well, don't order anything else but no cheese. It's apparently it means something else. Sky took police tells us Bryce Francis was working at Carl's Jr. and selling meth out of the restaurant. They say he fessed up to messing up that order. Hey, do you happen to know who this might belong to? And the suspect spoke up and said, hey, actually, that's mine. I was trying to make some extra money. Um, I really messed up. I put it in the wrong bag. Francis told police he hadn't even been paid yet for the $50 bag of meth he put in that burger wrapper. Actually spoke to the fact that it was probably one of the dumbest things that he's ever done. He was just trying to earn some extra money by doing that on the side while working at the restaurant. Police are encouraging people to check their food before eating it, no matter what restaurant. Corn Silk says he was given a replacement meal, but he won't be eating out again anytime soon. I already have a heart problem, so if I would have bit into it, it probably would have killed me. Francis faces complaints of distribution of drugs near a school, along with possession of drugs with intent to distribute. And this right here is the exact burger that they gave him for that replacement meal yesterday after the incident. He says he no longer had an appetite. He just wanted to go home, so he threw it in his floorboard and went back to Tahlequah. In Sky Took, Brooke Griffin.